Deep brain stimulation is treating diseases like Parkinson's and essential tremor, but getting the help you need can be challenging if you live in rural Nebraska. KETV News Watch 7's Josh Cristianto shows us how one patient in Waverly is finding her treatment at home. It's an uncontrollable shaking that makes life harder for Darlene Davidson, but with a press of a button, it stops instantly. Oh, it's great. Uh, I can hang on to a cup and stuff other than and before I spilt it. Davidson suffers from a central tremor, a neurological disorder that causes involuntary and rhythmic shaking. While it can impact most any part of the body, it usually affects your hands. This makes it hard to do simple tasks like tying your shoelaces or drinking from a glass. It's typically an inherited disorder. My hands were shaking really bad and I couldn't couldn't stop it. That's where DBS comes in, or deep brain stimulation. It's used to treat Parkinson's disease, essential tremor, and even OCD. Doctors place electrodes only a millimeter and a quarter in diameter deep into overacting areas of the brain, causing the trembling. These then fire a high-frequency electrical signal. And that can actually call, overact those, those um, or, or overcome those overactions, thereby calming those uh, high-frequency um, Errors. Davidson's neurosurgeon, Dr. David Vansicle, runs the DBS Center in Denver, Colorado. He tells me DBS requires two back-to-back -back surgeries. After that, patients must come back every few months to make device adjustments. But thanks to Zoom and an app for Davidson, who lives in Waverly, those adjustments can now be made remotely. But a lot of our patients have to drive, um, you know, several hundred miles just to get here. And have to, having to drive several hundred miles every couple months can be a, a, a real drag. We don't have to drive to Colorado and it took us about eight to nine hours. And now we can just do it on the phone. This technology is only becoming available now, and it's expected to grow by leaps and bounds. It could provide the answer to rural America's medical needs. There are some doctors here in our small town. There's doctors in Lincoln, and we're the capital of Nebraska, but they can't always do everything here either. For me to be able to reach out and effectively manage individuals from far away, telehealth and remote care are, are hugely important. For Davidson, it means getting back a normal life. Reporting in Waverly, Josh Cristianto, KTV Newswatch 7.